Hello guys, welcome back to the channel and to another video and another match day vlog in quick succession uh, where today we are going back to Longridge Town and that means we are back here with Will. Hi guys, how are you doing? It's a pleasure to be back on the channel and a seriously exciting day ahead. Yeah, today is the big one. I alluded to it in uh, the vlog the other day. Um, it's the 25th anniversary of Longridge Town and they are taking on Bolton Wanderers at home in a pre-season friendly. How are you feeling ahead of this one today, Will? Um, I think a mixture of feelings and uh, emotions. To be fair, a bit excited, a bit nervous. You'd think I was playing them with the way I'm talking, but um, <laughs> you know, it's obviously the club that I've been covering for a year against. A club that's that's extremely close to my heart so you know it's great that the two are coming together to, to celebrate the birthday of Longbridge and uh, yeah just can't wait. Uh, dare I ask for a score prediction? <laughs> <laughs> um, I think we'd better not to be honest but, um, but we'll see how it goes and hopefully it's uh, you know the ball take it a little bit easy. Yeah, um, it could be uh, <laughs> it could be an interesting one. It's fair to say, given the uh, the disparity between the quality of opposition. But anyway, uh, I'm super excited for this one, and uh, I will see you when we get down in the ground.
so half time here and I can't believe I'm saying this Longridge Town 1 Bolton Wanderers nil. Uh, sum up your thoughts uh, at half time if you could for me Will yeah unbelievable really um, you know I'm not, I'm not really sure how I feel about that given where you know where my loads is currently lying but um, yeah Longridge have been exceptional goalie lead always had the game of his life um, and yeah it's just been a really solid first half and um, Bolton haven't been been, been, t been too bad themselves you know they've had a goal ruled out for offside so you know I'm still expecting that they'll get back into the game but um, you know Longridge have really held their own in that first half and I'm really impressed by it yeah it's all set up for a um, a really exciting second half here and uh, should be a good one and uh, yeah we'll see you guys uh, on the other side at full time Full time here, Longridge Town one, Bolton Wanderers three. Uh, what were your thoughts on uh, on the game, Will? Yeah, an absolutely brilliant day. Um, you know, excellent way to celebrate the club's 25th birthday first and foremost. Um, you know, I'm sure Ashley, we've just spoken to him, was was you know pleased with his side today and can be proud of the performance. Lee Dovey had an absolute blinder. Um, so you know, every credit to him to keep us in the game and you know, obviously going in front was was quite something and. You know, I wasn't sure, you know, which way my emotions were going, but you know, Bolton obviously came back into the into the game second half and, and went on, on to win three one, um, which was somewhat expected. But you know, it was nevertheless, you know, long as did themselves no harm, and you know, I thought they, they you know, they, they showed themselves, uh, you know, that they were a great side today, and I know that Bolton were impressed by them as well, and especially, you know, the pitch that they had to play on today is, is fantastic. So credit to Shutty the groundsman for that, and and everyone who's kind of mucked into to make today what it has been. 
Yeah, absolutely uh, superb day. Um, Longridge did themselves no harm today and uh, a credit uh, to themselves and um, a great advert as well uh, for the quality of non-league football. But if you guys have uh, enjoyed today's video, please do not forget to uh, leave a like and uh, also comment uh, what grounds I should go to next. And um, if you're not subscribed, I would urge you to do so uh, with notifications turned on uh, so you never miss an upload. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.